later in this video. So are you gonna work some of your Rapunzel magic on my hair? Flower clean and glow, let your power shine. See how far you'll go when your hair's just like mine. It's so cute that Flynn is throwing Rapunzel a surprise anniversary party. I know, right? They are the cutest couple ever. Hashtag couple goals. <laughs> and Flynn said he had a big announcement to make. You don't think he's proposing? Hmm, maybe let's go inside and find out. <laughs> okay, she should be here any minute. She thinks I'm taking her to the snuggly duckling. She has no idea that you guys are here. Ooh, I love surprises. Okay, I think I hear her now. Get ready to yell surprise, everyone. Lights off, one, two. Surprise! Happy, Happy anniversary! What? Oh my gosh, a surprise anniversary party? Happy anniversary, Rapunzel. I know this day is about us, but who better to celebrate with than all of our friends? Aw, oh, Flynn, you're the sweetest. Thanks for coming, guys. Of course! We wouldn't miss it! Happy anniversary. And there's just one more little surprise. Another surprise? What is it? As of this morning, you are now the proud owner of the Tangled No More Hair Salon. I just signed the paperwork this morning. Now you can pursue your dream of being a hairstylist. What? Flynn, you're amazing! Thank you. <gasps> this is so great! Wait, can I go ahead and set up an appointment with you? Oh yeah, me too! Me three! Me four! Of course! New business, here I come! Rapunzel is opening up a salon! Oh, great news! I could use a little bit of her hair magic. But who am I kidding? She'll never help me after what I did in her movie. If only everyone had Rapunzel's hair, I'd have so many options to go to to be young again. Wait, that's it. Shoo shoo, I'm having an epiphany. Light bulb. I just need to talk to Maleficent, get a spell, and trick Rapunzel into turning everyone's hair into hers. Yes! <laughs> which hairstyle I want to go with. I mean, I've had my long braid for so long, but I kind of just want to cut it all off and go with a cute bob, you know? Let it go, let it go. I totally think you could rock a bob, but your long hair is so pretty. I kind of thought I'd get highlights. I mean, I already kind of have this one. Oh, I like it. You know, I was thinking about getting extensions. So many options. Maybe we should just go with whatever Rapunzel thinks. That's true, she is a hair artiste. Oh, perfect, no one is here yet. Got the spell book from Maleficent. She said I just need to find an object Rapunzel will touch and voila! Hmm, hair dryer? No. Shampoo? <gasps> Her hairbrush, perfect! Oh! <laughs> Ooh, this one. Magic powers of sun and day. Enchant this object to do as I say. When Rapunzel takes a hold, all hair will change to the color gold. Perfect. By the end of the day, I'll have an army of golden haired youth bringers. <laughs> Flynn, I'm a little nervous for my first day. Oh no, she's coming. Better go out the back. Rapunzel, you're going to be great, and it's all your friends coming in. I know, that makes me even more nervous. Rapunzel, you're an artist. Now, I've got all you need. Brushes, hair dryers, shampoos, conditioners, frying pan. Frying pan? Hey, you never know what could happen. It's always good to keep it handy. Thanks, Flynn. You got it. Now I gotta get back to Corona Castle with Maximus. In all my days of thieving, I never thought I would become a guard, let alone a guard instructor. But hey, I've still got my smolder, right? <laughs> yes, Eugene, you still got it. Rapunzel, it's Flynn, remember? Hey, looks like Moana's on her way in. I guess I should be going. <laughs> he is so crazy. 
Okay, Rapunzel, time to get your bearings. You've got your hair dryer and your brush. Must make everyone's hair like mine. Can't wait to get started. Hey, Rapunzel, I love your new salon. Thanks, Moana. Are you here for your appointment? Yep, I'm here for my blowout. Well, come on over. So are you gonna work some of your Rapunzel magic on my hair? I think that can be arranged. Flower clean and glow. Let your power shine. See how far you'll go when your hair's just like mine. So? I love it. Maui's not even gonna recognize me. You're welcome. I can't wait to come back for a touch up. Tell your princess friends. Bye. I kind of look like her. Let's see who's next. Oh, it's Ariel. Hi, Ariel. Hi, Rapunzel. Am I too early? No, you're right on time. Sit down, sit down. So I'm thinking about doing maybe a deep conditioning, nothing too drastic. Shh, shh. I've got this. You just sit back and relax. Okay, cool. Sorry, you're the expert. Flower gleam and glow. Let your power shine. You'll be part of my world when I give your hair a twirl. Okay, all done. So, how do I look? See for yourself. <gasps> oh my gosh! I'm, I'm... Beautiful. Blonde. I look like you. Aw, thank you. I'm glad you like it. Thanks, uh, yeah. Oh, this is gonna take some getting used to. Oh, I wonder who that is. Hopefully my next appointment. Okay, okay, let me get this straight. Belle comes here to get her hair done, and then you're gonna propose? No, 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 LeFou. I'm going to get my hair done and be a new man. Belle will hardly recognize me, and then I'll propose. Um, okay, Gaston. A, she's probably still gonna recognize you. And B, even if she didn't, she's not gonna say yes to a total stranger. They should call you La Poo because all you do is poo poo all over my ideas. Mm. Hey, what did I just kick? It looks like Maleficent's spell book. <laughs> Give me that, La Poo. I wonder if there's anything in here that will make Belle fall in love with me. Ooh. I don't know what this says. Gaston, give that back! Everyone knows that love spells don't work. <gasps> uh, oh, uh, uh, give uh, me uh, that! Uh-oh! Uh Look what you've done now, LeFou! What I've done? Oh my gosh! Your hair! What do you mean? <gasps> Quick, we gotta get out of here! Yes, Hans, I can totally work you in. No, it's fine, you're a villain. I don't judge. No, you can't get a discount for being a Wester guard. Okay. Okay, bye-bye. Hey, cuz. I'm ready to get my hair done. Woo, come have a seat. We can get to work. <sighs> Sounds good. I've decided to let it go. You basically have free reign, but don't go too crazy, okay? You got it, girl. Flower, gleam, and glow. Let your power shine. Let's mix it up, fix it up. Your hair will be divine. So? Um, it's not that I don't like it. It's just that I, um, kind of look exactly like Belle. You're welcome. Um, Okay, I gotta go. <laughs> Be my guest, whatever you think, Rapunzel. Flower, gleam, and glow. Let your power shine. Let's mix it up, fix it up. Your hair will be divine. Oh, it's, um, something. Oh, 
It's a, a whole new world for my hair. It's always been my dream to get my hair done by you, Rapunzel. Dream? More like nightmare. Uh, I mean, thanks, girl. Just a little trim of the sideburns, if you don't mind. Just a trim. Have a seat. Hmm? Oh! Oh! I look like Jafar! But more importantly, where are my sideburns? You know how long it took me to grow them? <laughs> Mommy! <laughs> oh, this is going so great. <sighs> you guys, um, I don't mean to be rude, but did anybody else have a weird experience at Rapunzel Salon? I mean, look. Oh, hey, Jasmine. I'm not Jasmine. Oh my gosh, Anna. Wait, let me guess. You went to Rapunzel's salon. You guessed it. And you look like Belle. I know. Don't get me wrong. I love her hair. Just not on me. You know? Oh, come in. You guys, we have a serious problem. Oh my gosh. No, you do. What's going on with Rapunzel? Yeah, she's usually so good with hair. Seriously, what happened? We should call Flynn. He'll know what to do, right? Maybe that's him now. I'll go check. LeFou, Gaston, LeFou, what happened to your hair? Tell her, Gaston. Uh, no, you tell her. I'm not gonna tell her, you tell her. Well, I'm definitely not gonna tell her. All right, let's meet in the middle and you tell her. But that makes no sense. There is no middle. You tell her, LeFou, let's, now. Let's pretend I tell her, but then you actually tell her. Okay, go. Ready? Go. Tell her. Wait, what am I telling her? W will somebody tell me? Okay, okay, fine. Gaston had a brilliant idea to get his hair dyed at Rapunzel's salon in order to trick Belle into marrying him. Classic. Genius. Genius, you mean? Smartest person ever. He meant genius. Okay, that would have never worked, but go ahead. Anna, your words hurt. Exactly. And then we kind of found Maleficent's spellbook, and then we ended up kind of sort of maybe fighting over it, and then everything went haywire. Uh, but we just found it there. A likely story. No, honest. I mean, I know it's hard to believe because, I mean, it's us, but it's true. I promise. You want it? Just take it. Just help me get my hair back. Uh, hey, Anna. Uh, is Belle in there? <laughs> Gaston, not the time. Okay, so you're telling me that somebody else left this behind, so somebody else is behind this whole thing and not you guys. Okay, I'll go tell the girls. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, it feels weird saying that to you guys. <laughs> so that's what they said, and honestly, I, I think they're telling the truth. This is crazy! I gotta get to that salon ASAP. Don't worry, girls. I'll be there and we'll get your hair back to normal in no time. Meet me there and bring that spell book. Hey, Rapunzel, you feeling okay? Yes. Actually, it's been a really great day. Do you want me to do your hair? You know what? I think I'm good. Thanks. Are you sure? I'm getting pretty good. Have you been using that brush all day? Yeah, why? Oh, hello, Rapunzel. Love the new salon. Thank you. What did you do to her, Gothel? Maleficent's spell book may have been found around here, but something tells me it was you. Oh, fine, you caught me. But sorry, it's too late. Rapunzel has made it so all the princesses have her magical golden locks, and now I can use any one of them to keep me young forever. <laughs> Sorry, Gothel. Hate to be the bearer of bad news, but your harebrained scheme didn't work out. You wanted an army of golden-haired angels, and instead, you've got these girls. What happened? We, we happened. happened! You two? How did you get into all of this? That's a great question! It all started when I had this brilliant proposal idea. It doesn't matter what it is. What matters is that this hairy situation is about to be cut short. And you've reached your split end. 
<laughs> that was a good one. Thanks. <laughs> okay, LeFou, she gets the point. Magic glow and magic stir reverse things back to the way they were. Whoa! What just happened? Last thing I remember, I was getting ready for my first appointment. What happened to everyone's hair? Uh-oh! Yikes. Sorry. Gotta go. And where are you going, Gothel? I think it's your turn. You're right, Flynn. This did come in handy. And I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you meddling kids and Gaston and LeFou. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Keep it moving, lady. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm so glad we have our normal hair again. I know. I love everyone's hair, but I like having my own. You know, I'm really surprised at Gaston and LeFou. They actually did something good for once. Do you think they're actually starting to become good? Oh, Belle, I'm a different person you've never met. Will you marry me? California girls, undeniable. Oh, you know, blondes really do have a lot more fun. <laughs> I mean, I have fun no matter what color my hair is. Look at me having fun, Belle. You having so much fun? Look, Look at this at fun me. guy. Look at me floss. I'm the best flosser there and never was. Yikes. Do you see? Ugh, Gaston, cut it out. Yeah, shave it for another day, okay? <laughs> Got him! I can't believe it's finally here, the opening of the Bippity Boppity Boutique. You've worked so hard, Cinderella. This is going to be the best salon in town! Thanks, you guys. Okay, I just need to make sure I've got my brushes, my curling iron, my dyes. Oh gosh, I do hope people come in. This is almost as exciting as the ball, but hopefully this won't turn into a pumpkin at the stroke of midnight. You guys, my first call! Answer it, Cinderella! Uh, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Bippity boppity boutique. This is Cinderella speaking. How can I make all of your dreams come true today? Hi. Oh, you're a producer from Hollywood? Wow, and you want me to come and do all of your hair and makeup on set? Uh, Hollywood? That's big time! Wow, this is all so sudden. Ironically enough, I just opened a salon today, but this is an amazing opportunity. Do it, Cinderella! Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, okay. I guess one dream can wait on another dream. I'll get on a plane right away. Jacques, Gus Gus, we're going to Hollywood. Woo-hoo! They already got the tickets and everything? Yeah, they said I'm flying Delta Hairlines. Come on, let's go!
somebody say handsome? <laughs> Welcome to our salon. Good looking. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Good looking. <laughs> what can we do for you today? <laughs> Wait a second. Aren't you those two ugly stepsisters? We have names, you know. Yeah, and I'm Anastasia, and believe it or not, I'm single! <laughs> what? I saw him first! <laughs> <laughs> ladies, ladies, please. It seems like you need some help. I mean, you're, you're clearly trying to be villainous here, but uh, lacking the full thought-out scheme. I mean, there's real potential here. Except you need some disguises. Disguises? Yes, whatever you're doing here, the princesses will quickly catch on and foil your villainous plot. Unless you have some disguises. He's got a point, you know. Yes, I sure do. And in exchange for my brilliant advice, I'll take a haircut. Just a trim. Watch the sideburns. You got it. <laughs> Did I mention I was eligible? Do you have a kingdom? No. Uh, we have a big house. Yeah, I can't be king of a big house. Just the trim, thanks. Yeah, put this on. <laughs> marriage, 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 marriage. Yeah. Princesses, princesses. So, how do I look? Still so handsome. Still? That's unsettling terminology. Siri, image search haunts. Oh, sorry, I don't have a mirror in here, but I'll take your picture. Click. <laughs> See, that's your picture. Definitely not an old picture that Drizella found on the internet a second ago. <laughs> ah, yes. Fresh as a daisy. Well, ladies, I'll be off. Good luck with your little, um, scheme. But he was right. We need disguises. I have an idea. <laughs> wow, these are perfect. Everyone will think I'm Cinderella because I look just like her. Yeah, and I'm Rapunzel. <laughs> yeah, sort of passable, you know. Oh, look. Here comes the customer. Looks like that frog princess. Oh, wow! Cinderella opened her own salon! <laughs> Look at us, two lady entrepreneurs. Well, I gotta go support my fellow princess. <laughs> oh, hey, Cindy, how's it going? Oh, hey, Tiana. Oh, you know. <laughs> um, how's the business for you? Um, are you still working for uh, Dunkin' Donuts? Uh, no. You know I make beignets at my bakery. Oh, I get it. You're joking. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, you know me. Uh, classic Cinderella. I'm Cinderella. <laughs> I'll be here all week. Wait, Rapunzel, what are you doing here? Do you work here too? Uh, yeah, you know, I escaped the tower. To come down and help Driz Cinderella because she needed me. <laughs> well, that is super nice of you to help out. You've come a long way from being trapped in a tower. <laughs> huh? Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> Anyways, I would like a new do. I put my hair up all the time. I was thinking something longer. Maybe a blowout. We could do that. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Wait, what are we laughing at, y'all? <laughs> Um, we just love hair. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Put this on. <laughs> all right, you're all done. <sighs> How do I look? I'm positively green with envy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I, I think. Do you have a mirror I could use? <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. We're fresh out of mirrors today. Fresh out of mirrors? I love you, Cindy girl, but you may have a little more work to do on your business. Anyways, I'm off to see Naveen. Can't be late for our special date. Thanks, girl. Toodaloo, better hop along now. Mm -hmm. Hey Cinderella. Hey Rapunzel. Oh, this salon is so cool. You know, it was actually a, a, a pumpkin and a fairy grandmother, she turned the pumpkin into a salon. It's That woman could do wonders with pumpkins. Uh-huh. That's awesome and great timing. I've been wanting to do something a little different. Oh, we can do different. Yeah, real different. Well, not too different. <laughs> uh, who said different? Uh, she said detangla. Yeah, we're gonna make your hair nice and real uh, shiny and stuff. And uh, don't you worry, you just sit back, relax, and enjoy because uh, Cinderella, or I'm Cinderella, Rapunzel and Cinderella will be, will help you. You never know how far you'll go in beauty. <laughs> what? It's a song from her movie. I think the chicken sings it. I thought it was the lava monster. Or maybe the pig. Or maybe it was that whale. Oh yeah, it was the whale. <laughs> oh yeah. No, I sing it. <laughs> and voila, you're all done. Uh-huh, you look magical. Uh, so yeah, we've got a lot of appointments and such, so it was good seeing you, but, uh, time to be on your way, you know, go show your hair to Oahu, that, that god friend of yours, bye! But, I have to see how I look first. It'll be a surprise for both of you, you're welcome! <laughs> now shoo! Priscilla! You're blowing our cover! You're blowing your own cover. Just do me a favor, okay? And don't talk to the next one. What? No way! You just want to take over like you always do! You can't boss me around. <gasps> you better be quiet or I'll tell your mother that you broke her favorite necklace, not the cat. about going into business together. I have a salon too. Not in your dreams. What was that? Um, uh, I mean, a uh, dream is your wish your heart makes. Yeah, it's a quote by uh, yours truly, uh, me, Cinderella, because I'm Cinderella. Cinderella. Oh my gosh, 
Who's that over there? <laughs> oh, uh, who, uh, that, 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 the, uh, that, uh, princess with the long braid hair? Oh, that's, uh, just, uh, Elsa. Yeah, she just, her voice is, uh, she can't speak right now because she's, uh, frozen. What? We should do something about that. Oh, no, uh, that's not necessary. Uh, she, uh, looks not talking and stuff, right? Yeah, she said she doesn't like talking. What? You do? <laughs> Anywho, uh, let's get to your makeover, okay? Yeah, put this on. Okay, but nothing too drastic. I once cut all my hair off, and it was a pretty dramatic change. Maybe just a, a subtle trim on the ends? <laughs> all right, you look marvelous. Really? Uh, yeah, unfortunately, uh, that Elsa girl, she broke all of Mia, so, uh, we don't have anything to show you, but you look great. Of course, I'm so excited, I can't wait to see it. Thanks, guys. <laughs> you know, when nobody's around, you can actually speak and talk. Wait, Tiana? Rapunzel, what happened to you? I should ask you the same question. Have you seen yourself? Seen myself? No. Look with my phone camera. <gasps> oh my goodness! I look terrible! But here, look at you. Ah, what is that? Uh, that's you. I don't understand. I just left Cinderella's Bippity Boppy Boutique. Why would she do this? Hey girls! Whoa, what happened to you guys? Ah! What? Ah! OMG, oh, what happened to me? I went to Cinderella's salon and I don't understand! Something is fishy. We need to get to the bottom of this. Ugh, Anastasia don't look now, but it comes that nanny lady. Ow! Oh, that's Mary Poppins! <gasps> Wait a second, didn't she used to babysit us? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I hope she doesn't recognize us. Hello, Cinderella. I was just on my way to Nanny when I thought I'd stop in for a deep conditioning treatment. All that flying's got my hair tangled. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, perfect. Uh, I just gotta go get that old conditioner. I'll be right back. <laughs> Here you go! <laughs> that old pampering couldn't hurt. <sighs> Ow! What was that? Um, uh, yeah, that was uh, just that pesky old cat, Lucifer. Get out of here, kitty! Meow! Okay, meow! Sounded like that cat just said, okay. Uh, yeah, he's very, uh, obedient, that one. There you go, Mary Poppins. You'll be the most, uh, you know, fabulous Mary there has ever been. Oh, wonderful. I can't wait to see. Sorry, all out of mirrors. Oh, well, it does feel smooth. I best be on my way. Thank you for squeezing me in. Hmm. To tell. Mary Poppins, hi. Wait, what is going on? Yeah, are you playing some sort of April Fool's joke in, <laughs> in not April? Yeah, you don't look like your polished self. You look a little crazy. What are you talking about? I just had a deep conditioning treatment at Cinderella's salon. Wait, you went to Cinderella's salon too? Oh my goodness, what happened to you girls? Who did this to you? You! you did. 
Me? No, I just got back from the airport. Someone tried to trick me into thinking that I was called by a Hollywood producer to go do makeup on a film, but they never bought a plane ticket. And there's no such thing as Delta Hairlines. Well, if you've been gone, who's been doing our makeovers at the salon? Oh no, I have an idea. Two, actually. Anastasia, you almost ruined everything again. No, I did not. You stepped on my toe, okay? That's rude. You think you rolled that in a bag of chips? Oh, the chips sound really good right now. Ooh. Anastasia, this is no time to talk about snacks. We're plotting here. Once all the princesses look UGLY, then all the princes will want to marry us, the most beautiful in all the land. <laughs> Not so fast, sisters. <laughs> you all look so ridiculous. Uh-huh. And all of your princes aren't going to like you anymore. <laughs> I don't think so. It's the split end for you two. Ah, you think you're so hilarious. <laughs> Uh-oh, is this what I think it is? Yep, it's a turn off. <gasps> Let's cut this short. <gasps> Shave it for somebody who cares. <gasps> you two should disappear and vanish into thin hair. No way, Jose, we took the salon hair and square. You guys don't even have the vocabulary to run a salon. Oh, oh yeah? Well, yeah! Anastasia, that's not a pun! my first order of business.